I'm Nick Quinters from RSM Tenor and I wanted to thank John who's described about nine tenths of my clients actually in his quick description of what he was saying um, and I think I'm hoping they were clients no, yes I'm hoping they were like that when I first met them but hopefully not when I've um, had my way with them. Um, so I work for RSM Tenor and I'm a director in the London office. We're a large size accountancy practice and we look after entrepreneurial, fast growing, hopefully, companies. Um, but like John, I think he's right. There are a lot of companies around, out there who, who call themselves fast growing and don't grow very quickly at all. Um, as a practice, we do everything that you'd expect a mid-sized accountancy practice to do. I've got one or two of my colleagues in the room. I've got uh, Mark who's standing over there. I've got another Nick standing at the back there. And I've got a Claire standing at the back over there. I, I was just going to say, it was, it's, I was um, impressed by the companies that you see at these kind of events. You've you seen a very wide variety of companies at very different stages of their development. But I think if there were hundreds of you around, the, the, the economy, the, you know, the sort of growth things that we're talking about would, would not be a problem. Um, one of the things I know that has been criticized very greatly recently is, is the Business Growth Fund which has been, which has I think got um, many, many more employees or t a, a number of more employees than it's made investments and when I send people along to them which are very credible businesses, they're very great at coming back to that business and saying well we really like it but we can't do it because and some really spurious reason and they're supposed to be you know, delivering some of the bank's money back into the, into the economy to help the company grow, to help the economy grow and what they're doing is spending a lot of the bank's money and you know sitting there waiting for the perfect investments to come along and that's not what's going to come along and I think we've had a great example of that this evening you know we, you've seen several companies there all of whom you know have, have some very positive in one minute or two minutes they've been able to tell us something really positive and interesting about themselves and I'm sure somebody could stand here as one of those investors and say but I'm not going to invest in you because and I but I think you know you did a great you did a great job and uh, and that's really all I'm going to say is is there are lots and lots of these companies around and we need to find a way of getting some funds to them so that they can grow and help the economy back to where it should be.